Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video is going to be my organizing and decluttering my makeup collection. So if you guys are interested for this kind of video, then just keep on watching. So for those of you new to my channel, my name is Princess and today I'm going to share with you guys what I'm going to keep and I'm going to declutter on my makeup collection. This time, I already uploaded my cheek product collection like my decluttering and organizing so it's already live on my channel now let's go moving towards on this kind of um complexion uh products i do have some foundations here um uh, sunscreens primers um what do you call this sample foundations concealers everything that are about complexion without any further ado let's go start with primers i guess or sunscreen sunscreen so i'm going to put this ones aside and we're gonna start decluttering some of the products here These are my sunscreens so I am going to keep this ones right here these are all new except for this two right here all of these are new this year I believe because they're all sent by um, different kinds of brands like I am proud style Korean and um, wish trend so all of the sunscreens right here are all new brand new i am going to keep them but i use this one a lot too this is the skin proud and this is like kind of more of a liquidy type of sunscreen that i like to wear on my um what do i call this my arms <laughs> and then um i i am also loving this one this is the art last glow base from hey mesh i love using this one as a primer and yeah it does have spf 50 here so and then i do have this brand new elf cosmetics um the sun touchable invisible sunscreen with spf 35 here um i haven't used this one yet so keeping this but unfortunately, I have to um, declutter this too. This is already old from last year and I have another backup of this. So I, that's why I don't hesitate to declutter this. And then this one is also um, expired, the Neutrogena. So I'm going to declutter this too. Okay, this this two right here, the Mario Badescu with the olive, um, yeah, lavender, and this glisten up from Fort Ray. I used this one before putting my sunscreen, so it's it's kind of more of a hydrating for me. And then this one, I use this one before I do my makeup sometimes, or before my sunscreen also. So keep this two, and then. I am going to keep this two right here, the e.l.f. Cosmetics um, Power Grip. This is brand new, and then I do have this Milk Hydro Grip Primer also. So I'm going to keep this ones, and then I am going to declutter this one. This is the AOS Studio Aqua, and then I do have this Derma E. I don't really use um, this kind of a corrector, but I do have one right here that i know it is green kind of redness a uh, primer so i'm going to declutter this too and then i'm going to keep this one because as you guys can see it's, it's it is still sealed and then keep this um the potty primer from l and then a studio and then i'm going to keep this um this four from l'oreal 
I do have the pore minimizer, the matte one. I do have the redness and the dullness, so keep this ones. And then I'm going to keep this ones also. I love using this ones and then this one. So the rest I'm going to keep. <laughs> of all i'm going to try this one because i'm still not think i'm still thinking about this one i am going to declutter this one this is the super goop so i'm going to declutter because look, as you guys can see it's not my thing <laughs> then next i am going to declutter it will be this one right here. This is the Fenty Beauty um, foundation. Actually, I'm going to keep this one. I'm going to keep this. I am going to declutter this one. This is the NYX Bear With Me Blur. Because this one, it is very drying. It's so dry. As you guys can see how it is so i'm going to declutter this and then i'm going to keep this too because they are new and i have the wet and wild and then i do have this um foundation stick from awa studio and then i'm going to keep this too um this is the kvd um foundation balm and i do have this brand new essence uh powder foundation keep this and then i am going to keep this too because these are brand new i have the lancome and y lys and then i am going to keep this too also no i'm going to keep this one i guess come on I don't know about this one because i really like this one what shade oh man oh. i guess this one is already You know what i am going to declutter this too because they kind of old so i'm just going to declutter them and then if i will see this too i will purchase them again or repurchase them declutter this too and then i am going to declutter this one i guess oh no keep this and then i am going to keep this too i have the dior and then i have the rare beauty keep this and then i am going to keep this too i have the uh, maybelline matte maybelline fit me matte poreless and the wet and wild photo focus in dewy i'm not sure about this three right here i am going to try this one I am going to keep all three of them because I can mix this once in a different shade, I guess. So keep this three from L'Oreal because I really like this kind of a finish. So I have this one. I think this is the W4 and then I have the neutral and light. So keep this. But this one's right here. As you guys can see. I am going to declutter this one because it's kind of separating together already. As you guys can see right there. Declutter this. 
Next, I am going to have concealers. Next, I have the concealers. I have this um, cream concealer from AOA Studio from Shop Miss A. I am going to keep this one. I have the green character, I guess, the concealer. And I do have in the shade Fair Ivory that I don't know if it's going to be good shade. <laughs> I'm not sure. So I'm going to keep this one too. And then I am going to... I am going to declutter this one right here. This is the 001. And I kind of... You know what? I'm going to declutter both of them. Because um, if I'm going to keep this one right here, the light medium, I will not use other of my concealers. So I'm going to declutter this too. And then next, I am going to declutter this one right here. This is the... Uh, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind because this one is already old and then I am going to keep this one because this is the most used concealer I have and I wanted to finish this keep that and then this one this one and this one and this one and this one are all new so I'm going to keep all five of them I do have the Dior, I do have the Anastasia Beverly Hills, I have the Urban Decay, I do have the LA Girl and Makeup Revolution I in the real life filter finish. So keep this five. And then I do have this um, ColourPop Pretty really Fresh one that is in Creamy Concealer. I like the first concealer they had, um, but I'm going to keep this one because i wanted to finish it and then i do have this two elf cosmetics um concealer i do have the brightening concealer and then i do have this one which is i think they already discontinued so i'm still going to keep this one because i like this one you guys can see it is very thin and it is easy to blend so yep keep all of this Okay, first I am going to keep the tiny ones. I do have the Veil Mineral here. I do have this very tiny translucent powder from KVD. Keep this too. And also this Laura Mercier. And then I do have this one right here also. It is a powder foundation. I am going to... Actually, I am going to declutter this one because I don't use that one. I only use this powder right here from Bare Minerals. And then I am going to keep this AOA Studio setting powder. And this is the brightening one. I believe they don't have this one anymore. But I am going to keep this one anyway. And then I am going to declutter this one because I don't really use a banana powder. And then I'm going to keep this one because it's still brand new. And then I am going to keep this one right here. And then I'm going to declutter this e.l.f. Cosmetics one. And then the rest I am going to keep. I do have this LYS um, press powder. Or yeah, setting powder. Brand new, brand new. And then I do have this Urban Decay translucent loose powder here and this one it is my all-time favorite one besides the cody um, airspun powder that i already decluttered this is very brand new i bought the light one because i used to have the fair light i think number 10 and i bought the number 15 i haven't used this one i believe it's still sealed so yep love this I'm going to keep all of this 
Now let's go move on to the setting sprays. I believe these are the only setting sprays I have. Um, I love this one. This is the Stay All Night Micro Fine Setting Mist from e.l.f. Keep that. And then this one, I think I need to change the, the spray on this one because it is not nice anymore. <laughs> so I'm going to um, change the um, container, I guess. And then this one though, I have to declutter because I love this one better than this one. So keep this one better, declutter. And then I'm going to keep this also. This is the color pop um, setting mist. And then this one I am going to keep because it's the Charlotte one that I bought because I still haven't finished this and I have the backup. And then I do have this um, milk makeup hydro setting mist. Yeah, so I'm going to keep this one. So now I am going to organize all of this. So I'll be right back, guys. Here are my products right now that I am going to keep. They are kind of not organized for you guys, but they are kind of more of a... I can see most of them. So it is much more easier for me to do a shop mustache now that I took out some of the things that I don't really use. So now I'm going to share with you guys the ones that I already get rid of on my collection. So these are the ones that i did get rid of so that's it for you guys i hope you guys did like this video please give this a thumbs up and see you on my next video bye they love me.